this video we are going to be learning how to scan a network with nmap if you do not know what nmap is nmap stands for network mapper with nmap you can discover the devices that are online in your network if you have a wi-fi you can know what are the devices connected to that wi-fi other than that you can find the open ports that are running on the device if you're an ethical hacker you can also discover if those devices have any vulnerabilities or not let's see how we can do all this with nmap let's get started i'm in my kali linux right now but the process of using nmap is similar for any other linux distribution i will first open my terminal now nmap comes pre-installed in kali linux or any other pen testing distro but if you're using a distribution like ubuntu then you can install nmap with the command sudo apt install nmap and press enter and nmap will be installed in your system i already have nmap installed i can check the help menu with the command nmap space dash h and press enter these are all the options that you can use with nmap however i will show you the most common examples of nmap so first let's see how many devices are connected to our network and what are their ip addresses so to do that the first thing i will do is type the command ip space a and press enter in the interface it's zero my network address is 192.168.1 and I'm in the slash 24 subnet. So the comment that I will type is sudo space nmap space dash s capital P space 192.168.1.0 forward slash 24. It will scan the IP addresses from 1 to 254 and this is a ping scan. This comment will show all the devices that are online and then I'll press enter and I can see the scanning has been completed and there are nine devices that are online in my network. I can know the IP address and the MAC address of the device. It will also show the vendor information, but since I'm using a virtual box, that's why this is the output. Now let's see what services are these devices running. So I will type the command sudo space nmap space 192.168.1.0 forward slash 24 with no switch. This is a default nmap command and I will press enter. And now the scanning has begun. After the default script has been completed, as you can see, I get more information. Now all the devices are scanned and the new information that we get is the port, the state of the port and what service is being run on the port. As you can see, port 135, 445 and 3389 is open and this is the name of the service that is running and it is for the IP address 192.168.1.2. This is my router. So that's why the DNS port is open. So by this output, I can understand since it is Microsoft, it is a Windows server. I have another Windows server running on my network. And with FTP, SSH and PLNet open, I can understand that this is a Linux server. And I have another Linux server. In a real pen testing environment, you do not have to play this guessing game. You can know exactly which operating system is running. So type the command sudo space nmap space dash capital O. It is for operating system space the IP address that you want to know the operating system of. I want to know the operating system of the server with the IP address 192.168.1.24 and after the scanning has been completed, I can see that the server is running Microsoft Windows 7. It predicted that it might be running 2008 or 8.12 but in general I understand this is a Microsoft Windows server. We can also know exactly which version of the services are running. So to do that, I will type the command sudo space nmap space dash s capital V space the IP address which is 192.168.1.24 and press enter. After the scanning has been completed, I can see I get the version information of the services that are running. I can also run a default nmap script to find any vulnerability. So I will type the command sudo space nmap space dash s capital C space the IP address which is 192.168.1.24 after the scanning has been completed I can see port 445 SMB is vulnerable and now our attacker can take advantage of this vulnerability I will show you one more command which is the dash a command so I will type the command sudo space nmap space dash a space the IP address dash a will do the OS detection version detection of the services and run a default script to find vulnerabilities at the same time so i will run this and after the scanning has been completed i get the version information the os information and the script that ran and i also get the trace route information now you can combine multiple options at the same time on nmap so i will type the command sudo nmap space dash capital a for aggressive mode space dash capital t5 for a faster scan space dash p4 port i can specify the port 
I will scan from 1 to 1000 and the IP address and press enter. I can now confirm that the scan was much faster. It was in 14 seconds and it scanned from port 1 to 1000. As you can see, there is no port after 1000. And I also get the rest of the information because of dash A. So this is how you scan a network with Nmap. If you like this video and want to watch more content related to Kali Linux or ethical hacking, please subscribe to the channel. Thank you so much for watching.